Hi, this is Robert from WarsawLocal.com and today is the 6th of July and this week the current President of America, Donald Trump, is paying a visit to the capital of Poland, Warsaw. Right behind me in the Royal Palace, right as we are filming this, Donald Trump is meeting with the current President and after this meeting he'll be going to give a public speech. But not everybody is happy about Donald Trump's visit. So today, we're going to go visit some of the counter demonstrations to find out why people hate Donald Trump. But we're also going to go visit the speech where we're going to find out what Polish people love about Donald Trump. So on, on, one, on one side, we have an anti Trump demonstration and on this side on this side we have the supporters of Donald Trump and it's starting to get a little bit lively various things we're here to protest Trump because he's uh, basically sexist attacking women's rights and yeah. we know that because in Poland we've got quite the same government we think it's climate change which, yeah. which is huge because we're at the moment where we where we have last chance to stop climate change before everything collapses yeah, yeah. and Trump just withdraw USA from Paris agreement so we protest on that and the third important issue is he's just an oligarch uh, governing uh, in the interest of the few of the most powerful uh, wealthiest big corporations and we believe that dem if democracy works it should be in the name of the people and for the people and Trump pretends he's just a regular fault but basically he's just a corporate interest guy and and that's why we protest uh, I come from the United States originally, uh, of course I was born there, lived there until I was 23. Then after I finished university in the US, I got a job in Poland teaching English. That was 15 years ago. I don't want to say that I hate a person that I've never met, but I will say that I am not a fan at all of him or his presidency or his person. Uh, and it was an incredibly sad day when he was elected. I, I think the biggest problem is that the general Polish population is not entirely aware of uh, what Trump is doing to American society is one thing. And another aspect is that he's, uh, they're not aware of Trump's mission. It's not to come here and support Poland, but it's to drive a wedge between Poland and the rest of Europe. Trump sucks, and we think that he's a sexist and a racist, and he doesn't deserve to be president of the United States of America, because that is a prestigious position. Okay. And someone who says those terrible, terrible things that he said about women and about grabbing them. Someone who says that a whole country is bad does not deserve to be president of America. No, 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 no. Because, excuse me, that's democracy. It's Mr. Mr. Putin, and we do not like Mr. Putin. He's in Putin's head. So the, this this guy's sign says, make Poland great again. Yes. How would you make Poland great again? Get rid of Putin and Trump. Kaczyńskiego, ale my na to odpowiadamy wolnością, równością i solidarnością wszystkich ludzi. Wolność, równość, solidarność, wolność, równość, solidarność, wolność, równość, solidarność. One is simply the quote from the Statue of Liberty and it's just something to remind us what America is supposed to be like. Yeah. We we cannot just do nothing while so many people are, you know, in, in, their back, uh, in their home countries are suffering and are struggling through war, especially I would think that people in Poland would understand it a little bit more because of what happened through uh, in a World War II, but it's not really like that. Why would we welcome somebody who is a racist, uh, who is a misogynist, uh, who is uh, not fighting for the rights of working people, though he pretends to do so. Why, why w would you welcome anyone like that? Paul, uh, Half of my family, actually all my family is Americans. And I'm standing here for them. You because I, I need to protect them from uh, their president. You are a traitor of America. No, I'm Shame not. to America my people family, like you. Uh, <laughs> my opinion is very clear. <laughs> I'm a victim of communist system. I was a scientific uh, worker with 30 publications, high degree. When the communists took power in Poland in 89, sorry, in 81, I was just nothing, a piece of garbage. I was kicked out 
all my career was scratched. I was unemployed because I was on a black list of people who were against the system. And then finally I could make my way out of Poland and only thanks to America and President Reagan at that time, finally Poland became free. So I'm always very grateful to conservatives of uh, America. Well, to America, America, Brexit. He says things uh, how they are. Yeah. You know, he's different. He's not. He's not a politician. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything he said he'd do in the campaign, he's going through with it. Even though he's got everyone against him, he's got Democrats against him. He's even got his own Republicans against him. But like, he's going through it. I mean, he stands for what he believes in. He doesn't give a damn about what everyone else thinks of him. We love him. I mean, we love him. He's, he puts politicians and establishment politics to shame. It's a new wave. It's brilliant. I love it. I would say most of Polish people usually like America. It, is, um, it always supported us when there was uh, a communism here. Reagan was uh, always standing for us. And it's, it's a la land of freedom. When Poland, the climate change is not entirely bad thing in climate change because if we consume more and more and more we create pressure to looking for new energy sources when we holding back and looking for or like using uh, less efficient energy sources like uh, sun or uh, wind uh, we holding our civilization back so i want that Mr. Trump should delegalize uh, Hawaiian pizza <laughs> worldwide. Do, do you agree do, with me? Do you like Hawaii? I, I hate Hawaii. Yeah, pizza. me too. Yeah, I no. Hate it. it's, it's yeah, pineapple okay. is the worst thing on the world. I have um, uh, an uh, ultimate opinion, but I'm rather for, uh, yeah. for uh, his uh, uh, politics, uh, I think. And his real politics, yeah. not, uh, not uh, people's opinion what he did. Uh, uh, 50, 40 years ago or so on, help, uh, help uh, ourselves, uh, f first of all, yes, yeah. but uh, he, he can do uh, some, something good for us, I, I, I believe for, uh, in it. Because I'm looking uh, Polish TV, when you are looking uh, TVN, you can't like love Donald Trump. Do you, do you love Trump or hate Trump? I love him. Yeah? Any reasons why? Can you... Because he's honest. He's being himself. Uh, my opinion is that he is being himself and he he goes directly to the people. He tweets, he uses social network, he uh, he's being himself. So even though previously you had uh, different presidents and they had like PR firms and other people telling them what to do, how to behave, especially with Obama, who was just like the first fake president in the United States. And on the other hand, when you have Trump, even if he's making mistakes or if he's doing good things, you know that it's him. You know that it's uh, basically him being himself. So at least you know what to expect from him. No opinion yet because I give any president a full year after he gets his first cabinet installed, and then I start critiquing or I'll start admiring the person. Polski rząd, jak wiecie, obiecał Donaldowi Trumpowi, że przyjmiemy go z otwartymi ramionami. Nie przyjmiemy go z otwartymi ramionami. A wiecie dlaczego? Dlatego, że jest wrogiem kobiet. I dlatego dobrze się czuje w towarzystwie wrogów kobiet z naszego rządu. Ale na to nie ma naszej zgody. OK, so now we've heard from both sides. We've heard from people that love Trump and we've heard from people that hate Trump. But what's your opinion? Let us know in the comment section below if you love Trump or if you hate Trump. And make sure you leave your reasoning why. So this is Robert from Warsaw Local signing out. And if you have not already, make sure you hit the subscribe button or follow Warsaw Local on Facebook.